Let's go straight to casting then. I mean, how the process of casting for the show, I mean, how, I don't know, were the characters set in stone and you had to cast to that, or was it more about finding a group of actors that you know would have a good chemistry together? Yes. Def definitely the latter. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> what did I say? Did you just say the word breast? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Boob. Boob. <laughs> well, the, o the only thing I'll say, just jump, jump, but, you know, one of the things that Dan did when he created this was he had all of these characters in his head. <laughs> and, uh... <laughs> <laughs> and he knew them all, and he knew their voices, and it was just so much fun to see these people we're sitting with come in and bring these characters to life. It was the most rewarding experience of the whole process. The Russos, like, it, when they, the, the, before we started casting, the first, like, huge win was that they picked up the script and said, let's do this. And the casting process was, you know, that was like, I, was, I learned from them that there's a whole art form to this stuff. So, uh, I would, wouldn't mind hearing one of the Russos talk about the casting process. I, it's impossible. I'm just going to be upstaged by Chad. There's <laughs> 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 a fucking thing I could say right now anybody would listen to. Why, why, did, uh, you, why did you cast Chevy? Why did, <laughs> <laughs> you, know, you, you know, Sam Simon asked me the same thing like, right, right, a week <laughs> after we did. did. Smack him? No. The, the, um, I mean, the, the casting process on the show was uh, fascinating. I mean, it was a, uh, you know, we always say that when you go in to cast a pilot, it's just a grudge match. It's going to take every drop of blood in your body to find the best cast possible because you're going up against 80 other shows that are all casting at the same time. Talent pool is limited. And, uh, and, and you know, a lot of it's getting lucky. Um, the, you know, that you find the, the perfect voice for, for every character. Uh, um, I'm trying to remember where we, we even started. I mean, I think Joel was first in, and it was, uh, 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 it was just a meeting that we had, and we sat down with Joel, and, and you know, er everybody loved him, loved his personality, and felt like uh, uh, he was a guy that we could build a show around. And what often happens with pilots, too, is there's a voice on the page, but once you get an actor involved, they sort of bring their own life to it and their own dimension to it, and then, the really adept creators uh, like Dan start adjusting to that voice and start picking up on it and making adjustments to the script and then, you know, uh, uh, fill it, filling out the script so that it, it fits the, 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 the character. Uh, really quickly, I mean, we sort of, um, uh, I'm trying to remember, when, when did when was Chevy, Chevy was, was next? next. We, yeah, um, second. yeah, I think we're sort of building the, the pieces that way and I remember, uh, uh, we sat down and had a meeting with Chevy, and he fell asleep <laughs> through the meeting. Then he woke, woke yeah. up, and he talked about his money problems, and they really <laughs> needed a gig. And <laughs> it was hard to say no at that point. Our, our first meeting, we had to drop him at an ATM, and I. <laughs> It's oh my God. Why do you have all that cash? He is flush now. Why do you have all that cash? I don't okay. understand. Okay. The plot, the, 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 why do you care? That's, that's, a, pack. Here, here. that's a pack you can buy at the dollar <laughs> store, oh, right? No, 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 please. Here. You can buy that pack at the dollar here. store. They yeah. all have. They all have Jeffrey's giraffe on them, right? Here. That was in you the go. Oh. Oh. You get? I told you, uh, season two, you, you get a You spat. go out and get yourself a nice piece of ass. <laughs> that's a, that's like, a product of getting a 2-3 at NBC at 8 o'clock on a Thursday. You, you make that kind of bank. He holds all the money. That kind of bank. But, <laughs> um, the, uh, we had seen work that Donald had done. Like a year earlier, a friend of mine had called me and said, you got to see this comedy troupe, Derek Comedy. They're online to go online and see these guys. And also, also Nick Cannon said no, right? <laughs> That's Nick right. Nick Cannon said no. <laughs> right? It's like, I'm busy. Uh, <laughs> I'm busy with Mariah. And right. you're like, OK. The, uh, um, Nick Cannon. Do <laughs> Donald, uh, the character actually, what's an interesting story is that that character, Troy, was actually scripted as a white character. It was originally sort of the uh, notion well, if I, that... Yeah, I mean, if I could qualify that, because I think that's so interesting, is like, the, 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 it was a sort of a, what we call race neutral in terms of casting. Like, everything was race neutral, meaning like, ah, oh, we don't have any preconceived notions. And that was really true. A lot of times you pay that lip service, but you kind of think, well, the dentist can be yeah. black. 
Um, but also, <laughs> but, but also, let's be honest. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty white. <laughs> I mean, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll spot white you shoes. if you want to. Like I got glasses uh, on. But, but. <laughs> But the funny thing about that character is that, is that in spite of all this race neutrality that we had striven for, it was like, it wasn't until we came up to that character, it was like, well, wait a minute, this character isn't race neutral, this character is actually pretty white. Uh, <laughs> because he's sort of this Woody Harrelson kind of, uh, he's sort of a lunk, you know? And, uh, but it was, at the end of the day, I think it was like, it was just an interesting dam that burst because, Joe just said, look, this guy's a star, <laughs> you know? And that was like, sometimes that is like the best decision to make. It's like, you look at, like, like is any show, we, we started watching YouTube clips of Derek comedy stuff, and I was like, yeah, we'll change the character. I don't, what, what, I, that, that doesn't mean adding yo, yo, yo before every line. <laughs> <laughs> which we tried. Which we tried. Which, which we, we tried, tried no, no. for like a little bit. If you like, go, you can download the other version of the pilot. It's pretty embarrassing. <laughs> All my life. Uh, <laughs> a lot of, no, lot of no, comments no. about bling. And, yeah. Uh, Run, Reverend Run is my dad. And, uh, he, he, keeps, <laughs> he keeps slapping all the other characters, and he's got a big, long, pinky finger, uh, pink, uh, pinky nail. Big pinky nail. <laughs> I, try and, I try and sell uh, Britta. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty messed up. But, uh, <laughs> 